I realized that the recordings on my band camp alone were jumping three or four decades and the mastering wasn't consistent and those albums didn't sound good to us. The yeah. music sounded great. I showed this to uh, a guy in Rochester who does this kind of restoration. Well, when I heard it, I couldn't believe it. it was like, oh, they sound terrific. So you didn't have production masters or you didn't have no, the No, because anything? back then we were selling things to companies, right? Oh, that then went right. bankrupt in the 90s. Yeah, I, I started listening and yes, this actually sounded just fine. And then the music hits you. And then Paul's playing and the importance that Anthony Braxton always described hits me. And then I start listening through other things, joint venture, my band, Four Horns and What, and the, the early trio that Ellery had with Drew and I. And it's like, oh my God, we did what we intended to do. <laughs>